What's good, YouTube? Good morning. Today I'm at Home Depot. You know what I'm saying? Trying to finish up the build, the van build. At least enough where it's comfortable. Because right now, obviously, I don't have my bed and stuff, as you guys would know if you've been watching. When I'm cooking in the van and stuff, you would see that I don't have my, my bed and stuff in there. So today I'm planning on cleaning out completely, putting everything back in there, and uh, finishing up the sink and stove top area you know what i'm saying and today i got some cupcakes from one of my uh one of my new friends i made some a new friend she makes cupcakes and look at them they look so good bro she made me a Reese's and a um red velvet and i don't really eat sweets like this type of sweets not often at all but and I haven't had a cupcake in a long time, but man, I can't wait to destroy these, bro. I'm gonna give you guys her Instagram later, if I remember, I hope I don't forget. I told her I'm gonna do a little review on it. So I'm gonna do a review on it, hopefully I don't forget at all. So I'm gonna go up in here and we gonna, you know, bowl on a budget as usual. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Cause you know my build isn't expensive, it's a cheap build. I'm gonna go get whatever pieces of wood I could get and put it together and finish off the stove and sink area. I don't know if y'all know, but this is always difficult to drive. It's kind of, don't really run smooth, you know what I'm saying? So it's crazy. It's crazy. You need, I feel like the average person would need two hands to like the average person would need like two hands to push it appreciate it you know what i'm saying but um i got a little strength and crazy though but today i'm looking for still quality wood but cheap wood because they don't have to be as expensive i'm literally about to cover up the the frame that i have around the water bottle for my sink and all that stuff. And crazy. Then clean up. Probably put some varnish on it. And yeah. You know what I'm saying? What's up, bro? How you doing? Good? <laughs> I just came to <laughs> I just came to grab some uh cheap pieces of wood to like board up my um You still working on it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just got the sink and the stove top to oh, cover. Wow, yeah. Really? Yeah, so I just need some cheap wood to do it. I don't need to get nothing crazy right now. Yeah, yeah. yo, they shot. thought you was funny, bro. Oh yeah. Wait, what we was over there? How much money we gonna get? Man? <laughs> yeah. Hey, y'all make sure y'all subscribe. Hey, it's pretty cool. appreciate yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. So how's the day going so far, bro? So far, pretty good, man. It's yeah. slow. Looks like my my coworker's not well. It's probably 25, maybe. I think when they spray that purple on there. So, That's this one. And yeah, yeah. this one. So he's saying this was this is basically 40, but I'll probably get it for 20. You know what I'm saying? This is lit, bro. If I get this for like 20, that'd be crazy. Cause it's more than enough. That's more than enough material right there. So I'll be able to do extra with that. You know what I'm saying? I'll actually probably be able to separate the bottom of the underneath the bed into sections so I could do the storage. Cause I need I need to store my water bottles and stuff under there my little water bottles about to see how much i could get done for the day that's why i started off early it's uh probably after seven right now probably about to be eight o'clock a lot of people trying to do it because i never i never done it so oh you I'm never trying. that's why i'm telling you that's the reason why because i know yours is gonna blow up if you do it right i got the wood finally um it was priced at 20, 23 bucks, but these are like a uh, little uh, defected from the forklift. So he said it should be half price. So I'll probably get it for like 11 bucks, 12 bucks, which is perfect. Because the last time I came, they were charging me like 30 bucks. Got it cut up. Now I'm about to check out and put it in the van and get to work.
that's a done deal. Um, man, talk about they started off great so far. The wood cost <clears throat> 23 bucks. I got it for $7, bro. $7. So I got more than what I wanted for, the, for a cheaper price. It's amazing. I'm hype. I'm excited. What's good, guys? So, here at the storage, time to get this work done. Um, I gotta clear up my van first, as usual. And um, I just realized I didn't really check the weather. So hopefully it don't rain today. But if it do, it's just cool, because obviously I'm in and out the storage, so I shouldn't, it's just, I, I'ma still get something done today. Hopefully I can finish the whole sink. And, um, you know what I'm saying? So this is for that. So I'm about to cover it up in the front, on the back. Not over there, because over there, excuse me, is where I'm going to use for my, my, my pots and all my little dishes and whatever. I'm going to cover the back of that side, but this side I'm going to leave. I'm going to only cover half. So I could still, uh, re re refill this and take it in and out or whatever with not much stress so today i'm gonna clean everything up put the bed back in when i'm done completed last minute i'm gonna organize my clothes last minute i gotta clean all the back of my seats out and you know all that and vacuum and clean everything up so let's get it So right now I'm measuring um, the height so that the water bottle don't really move when I'm driving. And at the same time, I don't have to cover the whole back of it. I could just lift it out and lift, put it back in. You know what I'm saying? So now I gotta cut it. I'm gonna use this. What I know, what you normally use to hang coats and stuff on. I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put it up there on the side, like right. I'll probably put it on the front here, and I'm gonna use it to hang um my mittens and stuff. You know, my kitchen cloth, all that type of stuff. So that's how it's gonna look on the back piece. So when I open the sliding door. I can um, easily take it out, put it back in. So this is one shelf down so far. I'm gonna use this basically to put all the small stuff like my, uh, like my seasoning and all that. So that's, that's one done. So I'm going to base, I'm going to store, I'm going to store the big pots, which is like probably two pots that I really have that I really only use under the bed. This is to get close, uh, quick, to get to my seasonings and stuff quicker 
maybe some spoons and all that but small stuff on this right here so that's one I'm probably gonna actually I'm just gonna only do one use under here and on top to put like taller stuff maybe like I got like a um, a ninja blender so it should fit perfectly here stuff like that you know what I'm saying so yeah yes sir covered up the front covered up the back got the water in there got one shelf well basically it's two divided I'm gonna use the bottom top and I'm about to finish this up right now so stay tuned These are to prevent stuff from falling out while I'm driving. Get me? So that's done. And like I said, I'm not putting nothing heavy or crazy up in there. It's just like some seasonings and little stuff like that. Which wouldn't be able to tip over this. So it's all good. See the back? I can take the water out and everything. I got to put a back piece behind here so I can also secure the water and secure the... And just put a back piece for the seasoning and stuff now it's time to do the sink so i'm about to fit it in the the top uh surface and the stove will go right here and that's a wrap i'm gonna put the faucet somewhere around here or around here wherever i got the saw to cut it right here guys so as you can see the sink is done I, I'm not done it's a little it has a little spaces on the side but I'm gonna cover that with some cork around kind of like what you cover around uh, for those who do uh, carpentry and all that type of work construction the the cork that you use to cover around the toilet bowl at the bottom and stuff all the little spaces so I'm gonna use that uh, my dad told me to put some of that around it so obviously you know it'll be fitted in there and um it's a wrap i just gotta run the the hose at the bottom connected to the water bottle then run another hose that connects through the van at the bottom um so the water the waste water could run out of there now i gotta just um put the stove on this side and i'm gonna also use this side to cut up uh vegetables or whatever too as well uh, when I'm not using the stove or or I have the cutting board so I could put it on my lap and cut so it ain't hard no big deal then the bottom here is done I got space for seasonings and whatever else my water bottle in the back as you can see I gotta run that little hose on top of it and we good man it's coming along man it's coming along feel real good man all I need now is my um my oh, I forgot the name of it it's my um the chair that I was supposed to order it's called uh dang I forgot the name of the damn chair bro um the beanbag beanbag chair I gotta order the beanbag chair it's on my uh, wish list if you guys want to um, check it out.
It is sturdy as hell. Good to go. You know what I'm saying? My stove can fit right here. Sink right there. All right, guys, I got the faucet over the sink now. So I still got to work on getting it a little, I got to get it a little tighter. It's a little slack. The hole, I cut it a little too big, but it's minor stuff. You ain't gonna really see that. That's in the back, but boom. All I got to do now is hang the lights up um, and install the faucet, run the, the, uh, the hose to the water bottle and just, that's it. You know what I mean? Order my bean bag and that's done. You know? So I vacuumed everything, cleaned out everything, and added my bed back in there. Sink faucet is in the sink. So, you know what I'm saying? Everything's clean right now. I'm gonna store some stuff in the back there since I got space for now, and that's about it. Everything clean. I'm gonna give you guys a full full tour when I'm done because I still gotta organize my clothes and put stuff where it needs to be and all that. So but for day for, for today I'm burnt out. I'm done. I started since like this morning, like eight o'clock. I'm glad I got that done though. I'm real glad I got this done. So I ain't gotta worry about that. All I gotta do is get minor stuff like the uh the stuff for the curtain get some lights and hang it up like these that are stuck here but i just gotta you know hang it up get some uh some magnet and the rain's about to fall too so perfect timing i was done in the perfect timing so i vacuumed out the van and stuff a little bit until i can really go vacuum it uh when i get a chance but yeah man so with that guys i appreciate y'all love and respect please smash that like button Please subscribe, turn on the post notification bell, and I'm going to see you guys on the next video. Love and respect. Check out my wish list. Peace.